Okay, with this model opened up, uh, to go ahead and paint this, we're going to need to first use our select tool. Select here. And we're going to go ahead and click on our object, right, to select it. And if you're in any other mode except for object mode, you want to be in object mode when you click. You want to select the whole thing, okay? Then, to begin painting it, we're going to look at tools under the rendering tab up here in our tool shelf, okay? That's at the, kind of the, near the top there. We're going to click on rendering. And if we scroll over to the right on the rendering tools, we'll see a rendering tool that is a paintbrush with a target. We're going to click on that and go ahead and we're going to cause an error okay we're gonna we tried to paint but there's an error at the bottom of the screen right do y'all see that it says warning some surfaces have no file texture assigned to the current attribute so what does that mean well we don't have an image file for this we need to make one sorry to make you start out with an error but it's important to know what it means when that happens. So we're going to go select again. So use your mouse cursor. We're going to right click this time and hold it down. And we need to apply a material to this. So hold down, right click. We're going to roll down in this menu down here, the one that we've never ventured into before. And this time, we're going to say assign favorite material. And we're going to go out to the sub menu that pops out to the side here blend okay blend it's named the materials are named after researchers if you um, have multiple objects in your scene select them individually while you do this um, for best results okay so blend will just let go and your model should turn gray is that, that work we right clicked and we held down and we went to assign favorite material came over here to the side and went to blend right now our model is gray Paint does not work quite yet. We got one more step to go go through. Okay, so um, generally speaking, on the very right side of the screen, we've worked with modeling toolkit. But generally speaking, you've got your channel box tab maybe selected. We want to select that third tab down, not the modeling toolkit, but the attribute editor. Okay, on the very right, like if you smack your right your mouse to the right side of the screen, attribute editor over there. We're going to go in the attribute editor. There's this window area here. And we want the tab that reads blend. And it might have a number, but blend. OK. Once we click that, we see a material preview here on the right side. Right now, we still can't paint yet. Hang on. You can change the color of your model or whatnot, but that's really going to be irrelevant after we deal with uh, painting. We're going to deal with almost all these settings at some point, right? But right now, I'm just interested in this color one. It's the top line, and I'm going to go to the right side checkerboard. I'm going to click on that checkerboard, okay? A window appears, a wild window. Now, our error said we were missing a file, right? So in this window, we're going to add as the color of the model a file it's going to wrap a file around that um, skin of the model so we just made basically we just made a new image file right so with our select tool again let's select our model and then let's go to the paintbrush again and let's double click it so we get some settings but make sure you can paint on it on your model okay you can control Z to undo some of this. But uh, this, this settings window needs to be up. By default, uh, the brushes are very, very small. So um, it might be kind of weird looking. Um, we'll talk about these settings in a second. I'm going to pause my video and see if anybody has problems.